Russia plans to establish political control over Moldova. Moldovan investigative journalists, in cooperation with news agencies from 10 other European countries and the United States, have learned about Russia's strategy of influence on Moldova, which was developed in the Kremlin about two years ago. The document is called Strategic Goals of the Russian Federation in the Republic of Moldova and was drawn up in 2021. The investigators note that attempts to implement a number of its points in recent years have been seen in the public narrative of some Russia-oriented political forces. The source who provided the plan to journalists is certain that the document is genuine. The strategy defines 2030 as the deadline for taking political control of Moldova and distancing it from its Western partners. The strategy has three main areas, military political, economic and humanitarian. Its goals are defined as 1. Countering the influence of NATO and the EU on Moldova. 2. Involving Moldova in the CSTO and other international projects under the auspices of the Russian Federation. 3. Settlement of the Transnistrian conflict through Russian mediation on the basis of the special status of the so-called Pridnestrovian Moldavian Republic. 4. Strengthening pro-Russian sentiment in society through information influence and educational programs. The source who handed over the document states that the strategy was drawn up by Andrei Vavilov from the Kremlin's Office for Border Cooperation. Vavilov is allegedly a graduate of the FSB Academy and had worked for the intelligence service for about 10 years before moving to the Kremlin. Another possible co-author of the document is Viktor Lysenko, deputy head of the Department for Interregional and Cultural Relations with Foreign Countries, where Vavilov used to work. 